I think that's pretty good. Okay, those are our rules. Those are a little big. Oh. Sup. What up, Brian? How you doing? Moo. Uh -huh. What up, fishy? Okay, let's go kill some dudes. Shall we? Should have been like that the whole time. Well. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. They won't prime to your P.O. box? What? Didn't they prime last time to my P.O. box? Hey, Mark. Thank you. Hope you enjoy them. Act 3 is going to be obnoxious? Bro, Maggot Lair is going to be obnoxious. Hello, hello. Okay, well. I guess we can go down in here now. Yeah, because all the maggots are going to burrow. It's going to be so annoying. I love the barbarian. I think he's a super fun class to play. That being said, early game, he suffers a lot. You can sometimes move past burrowed mobs. Mm -hmm. It doesn't seem like it's all the time, YouTube's you know. Upload and it made me smile. Wanted to see if it still works. At 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 Moo. Halfway. Thank you, Sinister. Halfway there. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, I mean, there's nothing in here, right? Just double checking. Okay. Yeah, maybe. Oh. All right. Happy anniversary, Daddy. Thanks, words. I think level two is cleared. I prefer single player to ladder. I generally prefer single player, I'd say. Oh, I have to break all the urns, though. Oh my god. I am overburdened. Guided arrow Amazon not considered? Uh, I don't believe I, I did much consideration on the guided arrow. Just be really hard. Scimitars are gonna ruin everything, I know. Moo? Give me so many I missed. Just okay, thank you! Okay, uh, level two, I believe, is cleared. That's our first area, and again, we can't go back, right? Once we once we kind of leave it like that, we're done with it. Move. Twenty six months, llama less than three. Thank you, dang girl. Appreciate that. No, I learned to get good smiter. You'll have to smite plus something else probably, but. Um, I, I don't know where all the best PvP sources are for that sort of stuff. Moo! 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 
Monaco! Hey, Evo. Do you have time to talk at some point? Okay, Stony Tomb is, is done. Aw, thanks, Daro. Stony Tomb is donezo. You're camping right now? Okay. So, yes, that's what you're saying. A go! Choo -choo. Thank you. Alright, I'll message you. Move! MWJ! SFW gifted a tier 1 sub to Suvi Madden. Aw, with the paying it forward. Very sweet. Well, everything in Diablo 3 is godlike. I mean, that's literally the thing. You're no longer just a, a person. Mm -hmm. You're now a god. Nephilim. Rickety crickety, thank you very much. Impossible. Appreciate you. It just wasn't called that yet. Yeah, but you don't really have the uh, the godly powers of D3, though. Just because it's D3. Exactly. Yeah, I haven't seen channel on that said 4. Okay, you have a 4-3. Four, 4-3 three. Four, three isn't, like, amazing. But it's okay. Move. Ted Zoon, thank you for the sub. Is the lore gonna be different in D4? I don't know. They haven't really talked all through like how the lore is going to be yet, I don't think, right? Impossible. How do I feel about killing everything? Tonight. Yeah, this is an interesting map with the triple... Triple squares in the middle. I'm feeling pretty good about out here. I mean, I'm gonna miss a lot more monsters now because we only get a single pass through. So, we'll see how much we lose. But I believe that is everything. All right, Rocky Waste completed. Checkers will miss the urns. I'm sure they'll miss some urns. It's just, there's so many. Later on. Speed run? I don't know if killing every single monster in the game is a speed run, but... Uh, leapers. Uh... Let me... It 
depends. We're either starting with like 200 or... Moo? Or My God, what a run. 250. It depends what mage serve wants. Okay. So let's... Oh boy. Yeah. I I double checked everything like a bunch yesterday and I think people were like I mean it was pretty boring and tedious. So today we're changing it to single pass. Single pass today. I mean, I can like TP home and things like that, you know. Impossible. People will come in and check. Was there anything in it, Ubia? Oh, whew. Thank goodness. It was funny how much we missed, though, on the second pass. I will agree with that. Yeah, like right here, I'm doing like Halls of the Dead kind of as a whole. So I'm digging in. I'm going to go down to the bottom and then work my way up through to the top. <laughs> I can't. I'm gonna owe my when this is over. Yeah, it feels that way. I might get zero dollars from this. Look how many urns there are. Turn off the PC when I finish Act 1? What? Did the, the scimitar is not spawn yet? They may not spawn down here or something. I know, it's all horn. Okay. Just a dagger. Okay, we got our tier rune. That's nice. Just need Rao. from trap chest I could have sworn I've had scimitars from urns Impossible. I'm not sure about that one I can't carry anymore. huh maybe you were
I'm gonna kick Urn. See? Okay, so Urns can be trapped chests. Son of a gun. There you go, so yeah. Everything can be a trap chest. Well, we are in trouble, huh? True, the ignited corpse and stuff. Impossible. No. Impossible. Saturn. Thank you. Also, we started today at level fifteen point eight. So we'll see how much experience we gain. Missed seven monsters in Act One. We're gonna miss way more here because we get we triple checked in Act One, and we found so many monsters on our check throughs. Maggots and uh, maggot lair is going to be a nightmare. Impossible. People come in and check at the end. And they go, you left a whole group right here, nerd. Can we find a minus 12 light radius playthrough for Moo Girl? That's, you gotta talk with Moo Girl on that one. I'm sure if you gave her a couple hundred bucks, she'd do some of it at least, but I don't know if she could do the whole game. Okay, I think Halls of Dead level three is cleared and two is cleared as well. Yeah, we did full dark. Not just no light radius, but the game was modified to be dark as well and stuff. It's awful. Bro, there's urns everywhere. Mover stream would make her hate everyone? Yeah. You think you love your chat until movers stream, and then you're like, hmm, I thought we were friends. They would be like the lightest things too, and she would just die. Oh, okay. Interesting. All right, Halls of the Dead fully cleared. I'm giving it the Llama Seal of Approval. Or it'd just be all help wheels. I'd be so mad. I'd be like, and this is where chat tortures you. And it'd be like, guardian angel, help wheel, help wheel. Eva would be like, I got guardian angel fixed. T 
total bounty for this. I think all all through the total possible is a thousand. The more likely is I end up owing money probably after all this. Hey Daro. Thank you. Do I have to break everything open? Well, they can come out of trap chests. So anywhere I go, they can they can appear. It's a nightmare scenario. Those stupid scimitars. People will come in afterwards and Let's see. I have to find all the stupid jugs, which I'm not going to do. I'm probably going to leave a hundred jugs, is my guess. Because they just have lots of random, like, here's one jug. Alright. Also, these big wide open areas are going to be really hard. It moves to the ladder. Thanks, I do. Uh, yeah, they should affect uh, the ancients as well. Why what? There you go, there's a scimitar! Stupid flying scimitars. Those are gonna kill me. Fifteen minutes is a long time for cows, but if you can't clear other stuff very quickly either, then similar. Next ladder should be end of August, start of September. Just terrible timing, because that's when I'm out on vacation. If you say, didn't you just get back from vacation? And aren't you going on vacation in another week from now? Yes, that is all true. We've loaded up. Loaded up the big case. All right, dry hills is pretty good. I mean, they're not expensive vacations. I just use credit card points for travel. 
And then, uh, yeah. and then just, you know, hotel points and nice Denali. Oh boy. You're just not interested in stuff. Oh. This is going to be annoying. Impossible. I'm going to have to pass around here a little bit. Three weeks snowboarding? That's a good good vacation. I can't. Not enough mana. Changes were on a big buff. Uh yeah, buff early, a little nerd late it seems. Kinda depends. It seems like it doesn't buff everything. Some things are slightly improved, some things are nerfed. Kind of a rework. Okay. Let's do... Let's kind of check through this area again really fast. Ah! Stupid birds. Quit flying! Oh my god. All these birds are flying! Yeah, it definitely opens up some options now. I can't. But grief is still just best in slot, I'm sure, so. Grief's even better because of the double check on the first frame. Yeah. Yeah, and then 4 FP. Yep. Wild. But before that, you have more options. Perfect. Best base for Oath? I mean, when are you trying to make it and for what character and stuff? For like a mercenary, for you to use, barbarian? I feel like a lot of people like to put in like a legend sword or something. Berserker axe could work, yeah. Legend sword people like to do for their mercenary, I think. If you want to give it to the Act 5 Merce. I don't know if Miss Monster people will uh, find him. Oh my god. There's one more bird that flew.
Maybe. Oh boy, here we go. Sure, if that works. Bear track, thank you. And Saturn Glide, thank you as well. And Narrow Bridge. Appreciate you guys. Oh my god, quit splitting everywhere. Today we're gonna get a first way. My god, there are so many areas for today. get tired of Diablo? No. Like I say, I don't get tired of Diablo, Starcraft, or Llama RPG, aka Llama Quest Farm to Fable. A Diablo fighting game? It's a Diablo fighting game. Man, Arcane plus the tombs are gonna be so exhausting. This is gonna be a long act, holy cow. I'm just now thinking about how long this act is gonna be. And how many monsters I'm gonna miss. Wait, did something spawn back in here? There's too many noises! <laughs> that is the hardest quest of all. Combat style. Be fun. Okay. Level one looks pretty good. Level two time. People will check. Okay, Ellie. Okay, I feel pretty good about there and there. Happy Lama, sad 
Nexion! Thank you. Hello, Mr. Llama. How goes the streaming? Good. I was wondering what it takes to kill Ubers. Tried it last night on my poison Necro with a dual griefed frenzy barb and a nice slash fire Amazon, but the bosses never lost much health. What were we missing? Thanks. Hmm. I feel like you guys should be able to take them down with that setup because the lower resist and the frenzy barb with the dual grief should be okay. Um. Yeah, I'm. Well, they have poison from the poison necro, right? So that they shouldn't need. Uh, open wounds is still probably necessary if your frenzy barb didn't have that. I mean, the poison would work, but if it's. Oh, they're immune to poison, that's right. The Amazon is going to be pretty worthless overall. Um, but the uh, the dual grief barbarian should be able to do a lot. No. As much fun it's as audio. Mr. Llama's voice as Gilbert Gottfried in my head is, I am tired of it being silent in my mom's basement. Fair enough, thank you, Audio. How did I miss all of those? I literally had to run right past that area. Doesn't even make sense. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. that I'd have to watch, like, see a video and see, you know, how the fight was going. Maybe he just needs more attack rating, like he wasn't hitting enough, and that was, you know, causing the issue. Um, it's tough, tough to say, honestly. Yeah, my guess is he, he wasn't hitting enough, and so the open wounds wasn't proccing enough, and so they kept regening their life or something. How much attack rating should he have? I mean, what, 15,000 probably? It depends what his level is as well. Lithiation, thank you. Um. Yeah, the, the the Amazon and Necro aren't going to do a lot of damage there. The Necro will do a little bit. <laughs> Subscribe to me, Llama Minion Bezos. Thank you. Yep. So, the Necro shouldn't... I mean, he could do a little bit of, like, poison blasting with lower res and stuff. Maybe to help clear minions and things. Uh, but, I imagine you still are just going to be having, you know, a nice life tap. And that's going to be your main purpose, is just making sure life tap is on, you know, the bosses. Uh, not too hard AFX. Especially twinked. Do I did I make a crushing blow bar build? Yeah, if you go to exclamation mark guides, maybe he can look at my frenzy barbarian guide, and then I think I have an Uber's layout for the frenzy barbarian, maybe. So maybe he can look and see what he's what's different between all that and stuff. Okay, maggot layer so far has gone better than I and than I thought it would. Now, how many things are missing? 
Does open wounds apply from ranged weapons? I believe so. As long as you get a physical hit off, I believe it applies. Any builds or Act 3 Merc is preferred? No. Viable? Maybe. The problem is the Act 3 Mercenary, and this is something that they need to figure out how to address, is that Act 3 Mercenary doesn't have any way to... Oh god, Cold Enchanted. To, like, keep himself alive, right? That's such an important part of Mercenaries. They're getting blasted, and they have no physical damage to actually keep themselves alive. Yeah, so your Amazon getting some, uh, your Boson having a little bit of that could actually be useful. If he had some open wounds, you could have the Boson shooting open wounds there. Because even with the Fire and Ice, whenever the physical hit hits, then it would work. They still have a physical component. I don't know if Miss Monster, people will check. Problem is, if I missed a monster down here, then I missed like probably like seven monsters, you know. But the show must go on. Maggot Lair is dunzo. No Nexus. Yeah, Act Three Mercies just don't have. Don't have uh, enough damage. Kill me, J. Denny. Cold Merce, good to keep things frozen. Yeah, but I'd rather run a, an Act 1 Cold Mercenary who also has baller damage. Or Holy Freeze from Act 2, exactly. <laughs> yeah, they found seven monsters I missed. It would really need to play extremely cautious. How you doing, Titanic Ant? All right. I believe the Far Oasis is complete. Challenge has two pieces. One, a starter piece, a base level just for doing it, and two, the bonus that then can get. Once again, I'm asking you to use your prime sub. Titanic can thank you very much for the prime sub, and thank you for the reminder to everybody that you get one prime sub every single month and in yours may be expired if you want to use it you can use it here you can use it somewhere on twitch you just click that sub button and click the little subscribe with prime it's easy it's free if you already have prime and it helps them out it pays the exact same as a regular sub the only difference of course is it oh. does not auto renew so you know if you uh don't renew it then well it ends up being worth a little less, right? But, regardless, for that month, it counts the same, and I do greatly appreciate it. As I do not survive from a single source, I survive from the generosity of thousands and thousands of people. So, 
Thank you all, and thank you Unpleasant Biceps for that Prime sub. Better not miss any evil urns in Act 5. It'd be a nightmare. Lose a dollar for each monster, yep. I can't carry anymore. Don't want to miss too many. And that money goes towards Moo Girls Applebee's fun. Mm -hmm. That's right. MMA Slowski, thank you very much. I am overburdened. Appreciate ya. Longbow, hey. There you go, Ellie. All right, ancient tunnels, Dunzo. People will check. Why did I choose this build? Well, I was thinking about picking in a sorceress for Telly, which I still think, you know, would be nice. But I thought, eh, you know, being able to have traps that you can lay and they'll kind of do their own, you know, it kind of is a good way to check for monsters, right? You can throw a trap, trap down and it'll fire if there's a monster kind of nearby, so. For that reason, we like it. A lot of people asking how I don't get bored of this game today. Did, did, did something happen? It's like the question of the day or the yesterday as well. Very, very popular question these past couple days. Like how can you get bored of such a masterpiece? Maybe. Maybe it just has to do with that, yeah. I mean, I would love to play like a Zelda randomizer sometime. I think that'd be fun. Always fun to watch you live, Llama. Keep it up. Thank you, Lord. I'm glad I live as well. Vaguely threatening cheer, right? Understandable, Warren. It definitely helps having, you know, all you guys here for sure. Makes it more enjoyable. Getting to share the experience with chat. 
Hey, J-Man, how you doing? Last time I played D2 off stream? Well, I mean, I play D2 all day, every day, so. I'm not playing a ton of D2 off stream. More cheating today, well. Thanks, Hero. Before I streamed, I used to play D2 off stream. Just do like full playthroughs of the game and stuff. But now, I mean, again, it's like I play enough Diablo 2 on stream. God, it's so dark. Chances of playing D4? Oh, I'll definitely play D4 through and try it out and everything. It's just, will it be, you know, a game that's really good or will it be not a game that I enjoy and want to play, you know, longer than, you know, just beating the game or something? Yeah, they, they made lighting, like, really improved in this, but they also made it a little bit worse because they, they built in a lot of darkness, and it, it, it it's a little overly dark, potentially. The darks are darker, yeah. Have I beat D3? Uh-huh. If D4 is pay to win like Lost Ark or something, then I'll, I may not even start it. I don't know. I'd be pretty, pretty pissed if D4 came out and they had, they had uh, implemented Lost Ark's pay to win system and been like, this isn't actually pay to win. You're just paying to have, you know, double experience for a time, or paying for a better chance at rolling your, you know, whatever. Like, honestly, that would be the most upsetting thing. All right, Lost City, done. Because like I say, Lost Ark is, is the great example of where I'm afraid that they might want to go. Because, you know, top people on the ladder spend hundreds of thousands of the dollars to of be D2 there. The design of D2 is great. And the darkness, so beautiful. It is. You should play like this all the time. <laughs> Thanks, Choice. So, you know, it's like, you, you can't claim a game isn't pay to win and then have, you know, the person at the top of the ladder spend hundreds of thousands of dollars, a million dollars on the game. Is Lost Ark worse than Diablo Immortal? No, but it is pay to win still. And they just like to make the claim that it kind of isn't, you know? They're like, well, you're not buying power exactly. But it's just, you know, I guess I, it's just kind of the problem with the industry right now. So corporatized, so business, so whatever. The like worst thing T 
to a blizzard exec's ears is that somebody is playing your game and having fun and has a million dollars but isn't like spending it on your game. It's like, how do we get them to put that millions of dollars into our game? If you don't give somebody the option to spend infinite amount of money on your game, then you're losing out on profit. If anything, I think the Lost Tomorrow is the way to do it if it has to be done. No, it doesn't have to be done. Don't give in to that crap. <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you talking about? It never had to be done. They just got greedier and greedier. Lost Ark is still a terrible pay to win model. Like. Nothing. You say people are just impatient, but for people who want to compete, again, uh, there's the big difference. Are, are you willing to just sit there and grind through and blah, 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 or do you want to compete and try and be top of ladder and all of this stuff? And for people who want to compete, you have to put money into the game. I mean, it's just plain and simple. And it's just trash but even still there's a lot of people that you know they they prey on the impatience of people by giving them the easy out of just use your credit card and you can bet your butt the game is designed very specifically to have walls built in at certain spots that will make you feel like you're compelled to put money into the game. Like that's, that's just the classic how every game is built nowadays. Have it have progress and then slowly remove that until it grinds to a slow halt but you've invested enough time into the game so you're, you go, ah, uh, okay, well, I can just put a few bucks in to speed this up. People will go count them. It's like saying Nigerian scammers you know and whatever all of all of those scammers online that are scamming your grandma are totally fine because the the fault is your grandma for answering the call and falling for the scam and giving her money to them like <laughs> I'm sorry we want to blame blame the person who falls for the scam <laughs> Truth sinister. No boy. No boy blue. Uh I'm gonna do a quick little once around. I just want to like get through this area and check a little bit. Okay. Seems pretty good. True choice. 
All right. All of the desert areas are cleared. Hey, wind. Yeah, I was out. I was out for a few days, so uh, we're we're back here now. Yep, now we gotta go do radiment and sewers. People will check. Yeah, I'd say the saddest part of pay to win games right now. Well, I mean, the saddest part is, you know, that how many people end up putting a bunch of money into them and all that. But a very sad part is a lot of the games are actually fun and could actually be really fun games if they didn't have all of the monetization and like pay to win aspect of it. Not all of them, but many of them, it's like, the game's actually fun and decently designed and could be a fun, like, game to have a whole PvP and everything in if they just didn't have all the pay-to-win aspect. Nice, Rare. Because it's like, I mean, there was... There's so many games that, you know, I feel like I've played through. Not so many, but you know, ma many like mobile games or, or games like that where you're playing and you're like, man, this has a great like competitive scene. And you know, like if I came back every day and was doing this and having to b battle through and whatever stuff, I mean, like it could actually be fun. This would actually be really fun to like try and compete with other people, but then they introduce, you know, the whole, okay, well, somebody can just put in a thousand dollars and then they just crush your face and it's like, okay, now it's not fun anymore. Yeah, and a lot of games, and that's the thing, they, they get you hooked with the game being good enough in some capacity, and then they introduce it in the way, you know, or they drop all of the, you know, they do all the time gating on it, or whatever, you know, I mean, there's a million monetary techniques that are awful. Yeah, I mean, they don't time get you in. They they have big choke points in Lost Ark. And those are, you know, Is my life sad or is the ultimate llama just that good? Not sad at all. Alatar, Dara, thank you both for the subs. Right. You can feel it. Like, it's really interesting. Even if you don't cave, when you're playing a game, you can a thousand percent feel the pressure and the pull in those, like, choke points. And you're like, ah, oh, I could just put, you know, ten dollars in and just, you know, boost past this real fast. Or 50 or whatever it is, you know. Thanks, Thirsty Bus! And then you're like, wait, what? No, I'm not doing that. But the, the, the temptation is there and you feel it and it's like, dang, they really have designed this. Can't. Intentionally. <laughs> Yep, and once you do it once, that's all they need. Because then you justify everything from there on out. 
You're like, well, it's just five more bucks. I already, you know, I already invested 10, 20, 50, whatever. I've, I've put, you know, uh, 30 hours in this game. Spending, you know, 100 bucks is nothing. Dolls will be a thing. We'll have fun with them. Maybe I don't play these kinds of games at all. That's why I don't play those kinds of games. I mean, you're... You're correct. That's why I don't play them anymore. What's the difference? The difference is one is being specifically targeted at you by the developers of the game, where the game itself is built to extract the money from your wallet. And the other is people taking over a game with bots and selling gear and you having to do, you know, illegal shady things to buy gear from it. Very different things. <laughs> Explicit design is, yes, the best words for it. There's always going to be people that are going to try and profit off of the stuff and that are going to do that sort of thing, you know, whatever, right? That's just going to always exist. At the same time, something like Diablo 2, you can, you know, go and buy the best gear and still get your butt smoked. Right. There's always black markets, but when the developers are, are doing the shady stuff, you're like, all right, well, hold on a second. All right, I think sewers... Three and two are cleared. Need to go over here and grab waypoint. So hot right now. I just, I just find that whenever they build the game with so much of that monetization in mind, the game always ends up suffering because now the game is built with choke holds in mind that are meant, or choke points in mind that are meant to, uh, you know, get you to have that temptation to spend money. Now the game is designed with, you know, you could look cool, but only if you put money into the game, you know, that sort of stuff, right? They, it's, it's constant little things like that Impossible. that are just really uh, annoying because again it's like I just want to play the game and enjoy the game and have fun but you keep being like well you're missing out on this or that unless you put money into the game oh that's frustrating instead to me. I invest my microtransactions in OARA social relationships with Mr. Llama and you that's can right. too that's right. Instead, you could be putting that dollar into Mr. Llama SC and his hand and knowing that you're contributing to date nights with Moo Girl. I think that's better than putting it into the pockets of giant corporations. Perfect. 
personally. But that's your choice. But yeah, it's just it's just the game design suffers and falters at the hand of so many of these monetization techniques. Whereas before, if you just sell the game, then the game, you know, you build the game to be as best as possible instead of building the game to have roadblocks and have things that will, you know, make people uh, feel pressure. Help me! Do I look cooler now? More guy playthroughs. Yeah, we'll have more of those. Andrika! Wow! Andrika looking so cool. Look at you. Gorgeous. I know. I'm like, where's all the scimitars at? Why Lom RPG is gonna have the dumbest monetization possible. Happy Lama said Lama. Alatar with a thousand biddies! Wow. Who is this big lama? Starting on this drum. It's me, bitch. I've been watching your charming series on teaching your partner D2, and Aww. I have a question. Yeah. How do you take the first step? Let's say your partner of 36 years dislikes video games and refuses to play one. What then? Hypnotic suggestion? Um, I mean, it's definitely difficult if they just dislike video games altogether, right? Uh, I'd say the best thing you can do is really try and just... You know, A, maybe they're just never going to want to play video games, unfortunately. But... If it's just they haven't ever experienced a fun game or whatever stuff, blah, 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 blah. Um, you know, you could say, hey, let's, you know, I'd love to play together, you and me. This would be a really fun time. Maybe you can make a compromise. We'll go and do something that you really want to do afterwards. You know. And, you know, just see if they'll play and, and get in on it, right? I do think there's a game for everyone. I don't know if this is the game for your partner or not, but... Well, it's online, so I can always just rejoin the game if I crash. But yeah, I, I would say offer some sort of compromising piece. After we do this, we'll go get Manny Petties or something like that, you know. I want no one touching my feet. That's fair. No. Llama RPG monetization is as follows. The game may be free or it may be like $4.99. TBD. I'm slightly scared of making it free because then I think people are going to instantly associate it with all the other garbage free games. However, at least Path of Exile is a free game that people enjoy. And there are some free games that are not garbage. So, you know. But I almost, you know, wonder if making it $4.99 or something would be um, not a, a terrible idea just to let people know, you know. So debating, probably free though is where, where I'm leaning. $4.99, but there's a way to get it for free. Could also be that. You just come in the channel and subscribe with Prime. 
$20 is a really nice value point. I mean, I think the game is worth $20, but I wonder if that would be too high. No clue. Anyways. Um, then, within the game, I'm thinking there will be skins that you can either A, find by playing the game, and if you find them, you can also trade these skins or sell them on the market, whatever it is. Impossible. For gold or whatever. Impossible. Impossible. Um, but I think you could also buy these skins. However, you wouldn't be able to trade them then. So... It, you know, it's one of those, like, any skin you could purchase, you could also get in the game. True 3D. True. So I'm thinking that potentially could be something. Man, this has, has a lot of rooms. Llama gold, yeah. Um, and then I'm thinking uh, there will also be a place where you can go watch ads and nothing happens. It's just that. Just a way to support the game if you want to. You don't, you don't get anything for it. And then there will be one boss that is pay to win. His health bar will be a dollar bill. And he drops nothing as well. And it will very clearly state this is just for supporting the game. So, I think those are those are gonna be the monetization. <laughs> yeah, he's immune to every attack except money. Impossible. Impossible. What's a shiny widget? Will it be on mobile? I'm thinking it will, I since it's turn-based uh, combat, I think it actually would be a really fun mobile game. And again, just, you know, not putting in all the garbage mobile stuff. So that's the current thoughts of the monetization for uh, Llama RPG. Why turn-based combat? So I really am interested in a really good turn-based combat system. I was uh, playing around with a turn-based combat that was very simple and I thought, man, this could be really nice. Like, if, if, if this was built out a little further, it could be really solid. So, I also felt like for designing my first game, having it be turn, turn based like that could be nice. As a, I think it'd be a little easier to make. Certain 
ter terrain like Final Fantasy Tactics? What do you mean by terrain? Yeah, it's, I, I fully believe turn base can be solid. Not yet, ma'am. I haven't done anything since yesterday. Diablo 1 is originally conceived. Yeah, I mean, Diablo 1 was going to be a little bit turn-based. It's, it's a different type of turn-based, but... No. Mr. Llama Wave. Thanks, Bayleaf. Yeah, lots of card games, board games. Those are all turn-based, you know. I feel like we gotta check more on this level here. Llamas versus camels versus children. Um, I guess I just wanna check in here really fast. Okay, probably good. The sanctuary, Amazon's obsession. No oh boy. Time for this. softcore so I'd be surprised if we died in this because we're gonna be way over leveled clearing we already did maggot lair so that one's cleared I mean the bigger thing I'm worried about is obviously arcane will take a little bit of time but the tombs are gonna be oh let gifted a tier one sub to great Maju so they much. have given three gift subs in the channel thank you collect Check. The nice thing about the arcane is at least it's pretty straight, you know? So it feels like we shouldn't miss much out here. Because it doesn't just have like big wide open areas for us to miss. Nice doorbell. So 
So I'd be shocked if we miss more than, you know, like one monster out out here besides something that maybe flies off. <laughs> no. All right, one way down. Pretty good. Yeah, like I said, I like Barbarian. I think he's fun. Nine max damage. Nice. Okay. Every monster challenge. For all you completionists out there. Interesting, Ubiya. What weapon are you using? Uh, it took me, what, six hours, I think, for it? Something like that. Definitely longer than it should have, normally. I mean, grief is OP. There's one OP item to have. Oh yeah, don't fly away from me. Spirit's also great, but that's not a expensive one. Anybody can find spirit. down nice insight so good First time I wouldn't be mad about a fourth way, right? I'm actually praying for a fourth way. Make my life so much easier. Save me a little bit of uh, distance to run. Could make uh, 
beast in it? I feel like some people do that, right? I don't know if they use an Etnax even, honestly. CTA and a Netnax. Never escape it, no matter where I am. But for once, we're okay with it. Mm. Thanks, Congrats Joyce. On the fourth way. Appreciate that. to do it this time, yeah. Woo! Man, shortage is so real. I've put so many points into energy, too. I just need some plus to mana gear and all sorts of stuff. Fire traps and uses so much mana. Ooh. Thanks, Lord Zero. Seven life, seven light res. Yes, please. All right. I guess we'll have to still circle back anyways here because we have to clear out both sides. Should be a pretty annoying path. Nice spam and all. What'd you roll? No, you res. Yeah, I know. It's like, oh, we're almost to the end. Just one more section left. And then you're like, oh, wait a second. And then I have seven tombs to go through. <laughs> the next man for stream last one kind of died last one mega died because my computer kept crashing um i think i've got everything fixed for it next one will be why is he not taking any damage uh in two weeks What was the issue? I had to update and like uninstall and reinstall a bunch of drivers and stuff. And then also, what else did I do? I just reformat a bunch of stuff. So hard to say exactly what the issue was, but I think it was driver issues.
Plus Windows 11 maybe had some crap. No, I kept Windows 11 because my PC is built for Windows 11. I'll actually like, get the worst performance going down to 10. Uh, exclamation mark PC maybe or parts. Should have all the parts listed. Yeah, it's 12th gen. Try exclamation mark parts. PC parts. Upgrade, wow. No, that's not it, that's way too old. Build. PC parts. There we go. Hey, Gigabyte. Yeah, I built it. Oops. <laughs> Arcane Sanctuary is completed. Woo. Yeah, the, the 1080 Ti is a beastly graphics card. The Moo Girl is using that one. I just upgraded to a 3070 a bit ago. And now all those GPUs from all the Bitcoin miners are um, hit it flooding the market. But does anybody really want to buy a used graphics card that's been burned by Bitcoin mining? Those things have like no life left on them. If mine in good conditions, maybe, but I don't trust that those are mined in good conditions. To <laughs> Nice riff. This is the 100% full explorer. Impossible. Impossible. So much to see. Hello? Hired hands to check. I know, dude. Feels weird. It's 
So many urns to kick. I don't think this will take. And we just have seven tombs left to explore. Otherwise, we've, we've explored everything. We've actually moved through Act 2 faster than I thought we would. Impossible. But there's still a lot to go through, so... False tombs aren't terrible. The main tomb is giant. But. And then, yeah, cause can be a little big. Yeah, we got Word's Leg. We are level 22. <laughs> Kermit. Which is a little lower than I thought we'd be, but again, we did, you know, the way we did Act 1 was a little different, so. Yeah, I know. We are counting the swords that stay in jugs, yes. Where, where is it? Ah, oh, it's an egg. Go get potions, and then I think we've cleared everything out here. I guess we should look and see where it even is. Square is the main one. So many jugs and urns to kick. It's gonna be the probably what I'll miss the most. How many monsters do you think I'm gonna miss, you guys? Single pass only. I have a feeling I'm I've missed something. I missed seven yesterday when I triple checked. To 
to give you an idea. Monsters and boxes also count, yes. I feel like it'll be like 13. Oh. Thank you, Naomi Nooni. You think in the 20s? Like, I feel like down in the harem, I, I've missed something, and, you know, maybe Maggot Lair will spawn some stupid, some dude was burrowed and I didn't see him, or a couple. I can't carry anymore. I can't carry anymore. Some random skellies. Seeing a low forty, nice. GG. That's awesome. Singer is really a fun guy to play through. Yeah, me too, Bio. Well, the cow level is not included in Act 1 clearance. We too, Arcadius. I feel like urns normally spawn way more. And it's been way less in this run. It's going to be all the ones that I haven't kicked, you know, that I accidentally missed. That's where they're all going to be hiding. Uh, Nightmare Lower Cross is still amazing. You can get Lem Rune and all sorts of really nice things. Foul Rune, blah blah blah. Exceptional bases for socketing. There we go. There's a couple of them. There's a pair. That's what we were looking for. Now I feel better, yeah. Oops. People will check. I am overburdened. Verify. Okay. Tomb number two complete. Secret. I can't carry anymore. I can't. And 
I technically going back to? Yeah, I mean, it's you can't like go back and do all the check. Once you clear an area, then it's cleared. It's just to prevent like. You know, like it was the next one. Hey, come on, lay down. Hey, go lay down, go lay down. Do you guys hear her howling? I am overburdened. Impossible. There you go, good girl. Mom, leave. She left you. You didn't realize we were here. Impossible. I don't have doggy cam because that's now Moo Girl cam. For Darcy, not me. Great. I am overburdened. I am overburdened. I can't carry anymore. Turn, turn, turn. the dollars on the Darcy cam I know. Can't. oh man I feel like you'd be I'm not even sure I feel like we'd be a very high level though probably in the 80s somewhere I guess I mean, Enlightenment is a nice, quick, plus couple of skills, which is nice, but honestly, I prefer just have it in the, like, FCR and everything from, like, stealth and, or just finding a different armor. I'd say most people aren't making Enlightenment. Generally not worth. Viper Magi is, yeah, if you can find, gonna be a much better... Thing. Even Q Hagen's is, and stuff are, will be better. Exactly. Jeez. Oh my god, the number of urns in here. Urn City. It's a really solid armor for sure. One more next. Okay. Hmm. 
Returning to play. Mm, boy. All the little things you can step on. Oh god, no. Ooh, there was another one. You got another, uh, swords. We're doing all clickables. Trap souls in Act 4. Those even count as monsters. I'm not sure about that. Well, we've our chat already voted that doors are not monsters. The best thing is to probably check is it in the monster, like, uh, category, you know. Is it listed as a monster in the game? It's probably the best way to to see. Yeah, we killed the towers in the arcane. Even though I'm not sure towers, but towers might be listed as monsters, so. That was fast. So needy. Hey, our row room. I can't carry Perfect. This seems like costume. Nah, this is just a uh, IES and some resistances. A lot of gem shrines today. Our fourth one. No. Mr. Llama Heart, Mr. Llama Heart. Thanks, Slick. Appreciate that. Welcome back, 11 months. Chaos Sanctuary will be fantastic, because everything dies, exactly. I don't have to clear anything. Impossible. 
Awesome. No, the, the drops have been trash, which is surprising considering we are killing every single monster in the game. Very surprised how bad the drops have been. Move. No. Rogan, thank you. Yes. Yeah, okay. Hidden urns. Yeah, I saw. It's interesting. More urns. Trap souls are monsters that don't move. <laughs> Debatable. Yeah, you get a lot of runes down in down here. Thanks, Knuckle. Whew. All right. Six tombs done. Squish the scorpion. One to go. Let's go. Whoo. Lightning Amazon? What? Llama? Lightning Amma? No. Just the word llama. Just liked it. Ooh, that leaf doing work now. So many urns. And so little time. Okay, all that's cleared. I can't get it anymore. Carry 
missed earns. So many. Found like five scimitars? Yeah. Something like that. Many. Impossible. Corpse explode him. Pretty good so far. Feeling strong. Yeah, you could definitely have one that would do that. You just have to mod it and figure it out. Earns, earns, earns. Kick all the urns. Ethron, nice. Can we make stealth yet? I don't know if I have a towel. I think I have it. Maybe just one it. <laughs> no, I never delete my single player files. I just move them over to another uh, save or another like folder if I want to. If I want to clear out some space. So I've got thousands of save files everywhere. Every kind of character you could imagine. How many L runs? Binders full of Amazons, exactly.
Just keeps going every time you think you're getting to like an end. It opens up into three more directions. You're like, okay. My goodness. Such a bad map. That would have driven me insane on a speed run. I'd have been so mad about that map. <laughs> yeah, we're we got a little partnership with them now. Sorry, I'm right. Okay. It's just urns everywhere. Impossible. I'm just going to hear it in my sleep, I know, right? <sighs> oh my god, more urns. The recent update with Whirlwind and stuff, it's, it's interesting. Make a beat with the interns. Yeah. Thanks, Young. You get lots of uh, urn cracking then, huh? Whoo! It'd be a nice snare. That's kind of what I was thinking. Magester is torturing me with this run. That's who. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Help me! Hey, Mr. Lame, a geography question for you. Uh -huh. What state am I in right now? How's that a geography question? Hey! What? Oh, well, she's. A, why didn't you just come check up here with me? I thought we had left her outside. Oh, no, she just. She was howling, so I brought her in. Uh. What state is Emroy in right now? A state of confusion. Michigan. You're in Michigan. Guess what state I was in two days ago? I shall There's one answer. Evils to the ends of the world. No, Michigan. That's right. Always in Michigan. Uh, yeah, no Tyrone yet. Okay. Well, I think we've done it. Are my checkers here? Are my checkers here? 
to come in and verify. Ubio, rag, same game and password as yesterday. Warren, do you have a non-ladder character to teleport around with if you want? You do not, okay. Any, uh, you only have ladders, oh my gosh. No, you cannot make it in a broadsword. No swords. Um, okay. Any, any subs in chat who would like to be a checker? Hang on, Ubio. You can come in and look for a monster. If you see a monster, you can uh, you drop a TP. Whoever finds the most monsters by the end of Act 5 gets a free Enigma on ladder. Many checkers. We'll take it through normal here and then we'll see if it goes further. $5 coupon to Applebee's, that's right. You can come on in Arcadius and run around with your Vigor Paladin. I've whispered to you. Non-ladder Checkers. Mm -hmm. Only the ghost in Fist's room, they just hit you and disappear. Uh, yeah, the evil spirits, I guess I'll have to clear out as well. I guess so. All right. Would anybody like to come in and check? <laughs> Green Avenger. Perfect. Remember, do not kill the monsters. Be careful of any attacker takes gamut damage gear like spirits. Retreat. So you just come in. If you find a monster, you drop a TP so I can go see the monster. We should have a couple, and you can help with checking. Perfect ghost, sending you a whisper. All right, so there should be a few people. Just wait a second. All right, once ghost gets in, we can we can start it. I guess no. Drizzt, I sent you. I sent you both. Ages, Lama. Yeah, Great this is to the see verifying. You in the community, less than three. Try and find as many monsters as you can. For today, we'll say whoever finds the most 
gets uh, this trap GC with 14 to life. Wow, I have a 40 life cold skiller. And other things if they want them. All right, you in, ghost? Almost. Well, that's great if I killed everything. I mean, more more people to look is never a bad thing, Paladin. So feel free to come in and you know run around. TM. <laughs> All right, hey Driz, hold on. Hang on, Driz, yeah. We don't need four more. We'll just be good with the. Uh... When Ghost gets in, ah, we can just say. Should we start? Should we wait? There's a lot of areas to check. Hello. All right, there's Ghost. All right, all right. Everybody go. Take off. Uh, kill all mercenaries and take off any attacker takes damage gear hostile if needed i saw somebody had a had a mercenary let's go outside here drizzed with me Come, come. Uh, just, just Merce. He's gonna one shot me. Oh God. He's slowly dying. Ellie, come kill him. There we go. Okay, perfect. Okay. Continue. <laughs> Uh, party please. Remember, if you find monster, drop a TP and let me know to come see. One lock chest gave me keys, no blue guys yet. Nice. There are all of the areas to check. Sewers, harem, uh, all of the outside areas, all of the, you know, stony tombs and halls of the dead. I feel like we did a pretty good job. You know? I don't think we have a bet up. I did miss one room yesterday. This is true. This is true. Your mom landed she, early. Oh, wow. She already landed? She landed, yeah. We, okay. We got. What? Okay. Hmm. 
There's... Yeah, a little scary. Nothing yet? Wow. Look at us go, baby. Fireball trap. Whew. Got lucky. Six urns? Oh no. Fast, yeah, maggots cleared. That's nice. You can go check it again. Is lying a form of cheating? Who is gonna verify the verifiers? All the verifiers are gonna be honest. <laughs> nice, Tim. <laughs> Who will verify the verify verifiers? That is a good question. <laughs> you threw out your potion of life. I would imagine if you th threw it out and didn't drink it and left the game and went back in, you could talk and get another one? You can't get it back? Oh, never mind. Mm -hmm. oh, monster. That's a hard bricked reward. Oof. Well, never mind. I didn't think that was a uh, hard hard bricked. Looking good. Let's go, baby. <laughs> really, Horn? Not off the hook yet. I mean, there's still plenty to see. I can't. Party up, Ubio. Impossible. Gory. That is gross. What up, Jim? How you doing, bro? Trios, nice. Hey. <laughs> Need a little bit of luck. What chest? Moo. Nothing. Whew. Marcus, thank you. Ooh, nice GM Furious. Yeah, so we just cleared out all of Act 2, and now we're having people run around and check everything to see if they can find any monsters that I missed. Uh, you can press R, N, or H.
Oh, thanks, Marcus. Welcome around. Truth the Natus. Rocky Ways clear. Let's go, baby. Is this the perfect act two? Did I somehow clear every monster on a single pass? Okay, what don't jinx it? That would be crazy. Moon clear, canyon clear, nice. This is this is making my heart race. Yep, we did all seven tombs. How long does this take? Um, how long did it take for Act 2? Probably like three hours? Act 2 is big, man. When you really dive into every single area. Act 3 is going to be decent sized as well. Yesterday. Oh, it's in my car. In the thingy, because I put it there. Okay. <clears throat> you almost done? Yep. We're almost done. Moogirl appreciation time. Yeah! Moogirl appreciation time. Everybody say something nice about Moogirl. He thinks he's going to get this. Him. Darcy, don't step on my fresh toes! Ooh. Oh, they look great. Wow. Oh, she so wants to spend all your money. That's right. <laughs> he wants to spend all my money. That is the truth. You still have to do dishes and. Moo girl is awesome. Moo. Moo girl is cool, unlike you. <laughs> you make the best pies. Mm, not sure about that. Join my army of the dead. I appreciate moo pies. You like moo pies? <laughs> I'm, I'm not so so much a fan personally. Join my army of the dead. Something nice Ouch, to move. Flightless. Out. Moo has a better stream. Wow. <laughs> Thanks for accidentally Join pying llama. Uh huh. Thanatos. <laughs> Thanks for accidentally pying llama. I uh -huh. didn't say anything, Moo girl. Wow. I think we've done it, guys. I think everything is cleared and there's no monsters. Where do you guys think is left to check? Mama Lama sitting at the airport. Poor Mama Yeah, but Lama. she has to get her bag. She checked it. That'll be 20 minutes at least. GG. Thank you, Ghost. Llama has a good stream. Moose is just better. I mean, she does have a great stream. <laughs> Exclamation mark Moo. We are like 25 followers away from a thousand. Wow. And like 25 subscriptions away from a crunchy peanut butter pie. Okay, that's not happening. All right. Mugger responds back to messages. Okay. <laughs> okay. Join my I, to <laughs> Thanks, I still think you cheated. In Take my bits on a good long. run. It's just me. Mm -hmm. Unlooted skeleton is empty. Whew. Palace clear. Hidden corpse guard left in Lost City. Hopefully nothing. Everyone found zero monsters, so everyone won. Uh, that means llama wins if every if there's zero monsters.
What's left to check? That's what I'm wondering. Feels like you guys have gone through. Uh, harem slash jails. Arcane sewer, ancient, and tombs. Harem and jails are done. Palace is done. I'm not sure what's left, Moo. I think we did it. Yeah, they did all the tombs. Snakes and halls would be good to check. Snakes is actually probably... Okay, snakes are checked. Halls are checked. Maggot's been double-checked. Stony Tomb was checked. I think we did it all. That's my... All wrong tombs? Yeah, he checked all the wrong tombs. Wow. High five. Woo! We did it!